Hello everyone, this is Eda Golami from Akhmet Soft Research Lab and in today's video, I'm going to teach you how to import your CSV file to QGIS. So first of all, this is the interface of QGIS. In order to import your CSV file, go to Layer and click on Add Layer. Um, I'm sorry, uh, hover on Add Layer and then Add Delimited Text Layer. Click on that. And then you can see this window opens up. So in file name, you can see it has three dots in here. Click on that. Go to your, um, you know, folder and select your file. This is my file. And then you can see the layer name gets into here. And in file format, you can see the format is CSV as default. If it's not recognized correctly, you can select each of these one. Okay. So if you click on regular expression delimiter, you can, you can define what is the expression. Okay. So you can change it or in custom delimiters. Uh, also, if you click and that you can also check tab column space comma semicolon or if it's not mentioned in here you can uh, just type it in here okay so mine is csv comma separated values so my uh, my numbers or values are separated using comma so it's just um, explained in here and then number of header lines to this card. So in here you can mention how how many um you know how many rows should be uh, discarded should be not uh, considered. And then you get into here first record has failed names. Um, so mine is is just like that. I have X U T M and Y U T M. If you do not, um you know if you uncheck that, you can see it it is considered as your first row which is incorrect okay so and then also other um options in here i pass them and in geometry definition i have point coordinates okay and i have my x field as correctly recognized as xutm which i have in my file and y field is yutm which i have written okay and then geometry crs it's also recognized correctly so i do not change that and i click apply so you can see my points are now shown in the um in the map view of the qgis and if I want to check whether they are uh, shown correctly or not, I can simply go to web and in quick map services, if you do not have installed that yet, you can watch my other videos about that. How to bring Google um, images into QIJS and etc. And you can see how to do it. And, and then go to Google and Google hybrid and that's it you can see your you can see where your data are placed okay so if i just change the size click apply okay you can see my data are shown correctly in here so that's it for today's video i hope you learned something new please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel i will see you next videos and bye